So what's up, everybody? Welcome back to our Patreon. Um, if you watched the last episode, Savon said we are no longer introducing ourselves because it is pointless because you guys know us. That's why you're subscribed to this. So hello, we are back. We're back. <laughs> This is a very exciting episode, and also I want to encourage you guys to do this because something great happened uh, from this. Shout out to Austin. I have his comment right here. He's a subscriber, and he really gave us the pretty much the whole basis of this episode, so please, we encourage you guys. He Salute. left a comment. He suggested a topic. You could ask us things, advice, but he left a topic, and he was like, do you guys collect any physical media? You know, with you guys being in the music industry, Alex being so heavy into music, Reggie and journalism, it'll be interesting to hear your thoughts on, like, you know digital versus physical and thank you to mason who threw this in the chat i don't know if it was kieran or mason but i literally saw this and i was like boy do you do i have something for <laughs> do i have know. something for you austin i do <laughs> i have a treat for you low treat, low treat. but i mean before i s go off i just feel like i'm gonna be talking a lot so i just want to check in how are you guys doing i just want you guys to talk a little bit first because i'm about to take this off the fucking rails <laughs> Oh, ready, go. I'm, no, 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 you guys, no, you guys answer, we're, please. We're I feel great. Amazing. I feel great. Yeah. And um, out of embarrassment, like normally I don't do things and know I'm going to come in third place. But <laughs> since today, I feel like I'm not going to have much to contribute. I'm going to just put my glasses on because <laughs> I may be looking down while listening. No. Um, as far as physical media, though, I haven't really collected physical media. What I do like to do is I like yeah. to buy my favorite artist merch or an album. Yeah. I, I buy the merch. Or I like to physically purchase, well, not, I guess it's not physically, it's still digital, but I like to digital. buy music. Like when mm -hmm. I really fuck with an artist or I really like fuck iTunes. with albums, I like to, yeah, mm -hmm. I like to buy the music, mm -hmm. but I'm not really a collectibles guy. As y'all know, I move, I do a lot yeah. of moving around, so yeah. I don't Which like to hoard. Into. Yeah, I can't really, I can't really <laughs> hoard things as much as I would like to, so I don't. <gasps> have a lot of physical media. wow i'm so glad yeah. you said that word because we literally talked about in the last episode how i am very stable like i've i've lived at the same residence for 20 years which yeah. is why i do think i'm able to hoard these things like i think that is, that is really directly mm -hmm. correlated with that that is so interesting yeah yeah i don't have any collectibles a certain level of attachment to them mm -hmm. that makes sense that makes sense your boy okay, don't get so... attached <laughs> <clears throat> so he that asked if i collect physical media i'm sure he meant you know, vinyls, you know, just yeah. just the level one shit. Okay. Oh, she's shooting. So, so um, <laughs> I don't know where to start. I'm so overwhelmed. So to start off oh, strongly. I feel like, uh, okay. like yeah. I feel like you're presenting in the class. Yeah, and I'm, I love I love public speaking, <laughs> yeah. so yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll start off strong with the first CD. We have Snoop Dogg, Snoop World. Ooh. What? I was not expecting that at Ludacris, all. Ludacris release therapy. <laughs> Why do you have Ludacris's release therapy on CD? Usher, you got a bad. Okay. What? I was She's not expecting right this. She's Whitney Houston, I'm your baby tonight. No, you didn't. Boys to Men, Motown Philly. <laughs> you got me. You got me. You got me. LL Cool J. <laughs> Uncle L. Uncle no, this is L. level one. This is level one, guys. This is level one. Wait, chill. But it's but I'm not gonna lie. Some of those albums you just pulled out, Reggie, were like B side sort of albums. Oh yeah, they're not sense. like the main. I, you know that Ludacris album? Really? That was Jay Z. One of it was Jay Z. Classic. Volume two, Hard Knock Life. Hard Classic. Knock. We got some more Whitney Houston. Wow, you. We love got Whitney. Mariah Carey. <laughs> Yo, oh, where do you keep this? Where do you do you like what the fuck? In my wow. in my room. That's why I don't want to move because I have a big ass room and I'm like not moving all this shit. <laughs> um That is incredible. I, also included I get I feel like you guys weren't ready for that. I was not. I, now you started out with Snoop better. was kind of crazy. It gets better. And like, that's memorabilia too. I just yeah, I don't like show these things off. These are really genuinely yeah. because it fills my soul. Right. Um and also included in tier one, I would say are magazines. I have this is tier mm. one. Migos when they were on Rolling Stone. Nice. I okay. Have a ton of Billboard stuff. Like this is J. Cole, Billboard stuff. I have Reggie, I need you to hold it a little bit longer to the camera. Oh, sorry. Like, I need you. I need you to really show us. All right. Show I don't uh, you feel me? Like, look at wow. this. J. Cole slam wow. cover, you know? This is crazy. Wow. Some light, you know, when he was hooping or whatever. Um, and honestly, I just have so I have stacks and stacks on magazines, so I can't like I don't know. I can't get That's really into one? that. Those are some highlights. We have, oh my God, we have, you know, when Kendrick was on the cover of Billboard. Hard. Yes. Yeah. Hard. 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 So hard. 
I have a lot of that. We could do in depth one day if you guys are. Let us know in the comments if you want me to go on. But the good stuff is the records. So I have like a mm. lot of records and fun fact about. I'll tell a little fun fact. So this one, the belly one. Mm. Classic. And then. How do you have this? She? I have no idea. Rockefeller. <laughs> this is crazy. Okay, I, so I what, want everybody. I want the listeners to know as Reggie wait, is pulling out all of these these artifacts, these hip hop artifacts, artifacts right? <laughs> like <laughs> this is a prime <laughs> example of being true to this and not new to this. Not okay? new oh. to this. This is fucking <laughs> a prime example because I know a lot of people listen to us because of our age, right? Yeah, and because yeah, of maybe yeah. some of the things we're into, or because of true our peers, like. People don't really realize we yeah. are about this life. And when I say we, uh, I mean yeah. Reggie. I mean Reggie. Yeah. No, you <laughs> really about this shit. Go on but it's, 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 it's really great to see this. And I'm, I hope yeah. somebody has a new appreciation for your insight and for your takes. Because I know a lot yeah. of people think that you just get microphones, you turn yeah, on the right. camera, right. and you're a potter. Like, no, yeah, we no. are really in this shit. We love this nigga. music shit. We love this music shit. No, and it's Bruh. like... Yeah, really? I couldn't just I couldn't just do this overnight. But speaking of like current stuff, even right. what we were talking about, Drake versus Kendrick, it happened this year. I bought that on cassette because why I just do shit like that. <laughs> that was hard. I saw you were I saw you cop that and I was like, like Damn, why I would I have that. to do this? I just do it, like you know. That's so yeah. hard. Um, but a fun what? fact about the Rockefeller and Belly one, yeah. That I have plenty of I can't do the vinyls because they're like hung up on my wall, but um those two specifically. Before, you know, this is why I knew he was the one. My boyfriend, John, yeah. uh, we had our first date. It was like, uh, whatchamacallit? It was, it was like a week before my birthday or something. And he mm. peeped that it was my birthday coming up before our first date. Like, we didn't, like, date yet. And he, I, like, drunk called him, like, the night before. And he was, <laughs> like, oh, like, just talking to me and stuff. And he was like, oh, by the way, I peeped it was your birthday. I got you a birthday present. And it was those records. Isn't that crazy? Oh, wow. Wait, which one specifically? The Rockefeller and Belly ones. The Rockefeller and Belly ones. Yeah. See, John is, that's amazing. Isn't that so cute? I'm so and, glad he's taking. that's so early on. I'm so glad right. I don't got to compete with this nigga. Save thank on. God. <laughs> like, oh, yo, Reggie, thank you for taking him yeah, off no. the streets. Honestly. I know. like. What yeah. the fuck was I supposed to do when there's men yeah. out there that's doing, doing this? shit like that? Yeah. Like, wow, well, yeah, ah, oh, shit. You but I feel like one. you guys would, wouldn't you? You guys are thoughtful. You guys would do stuff like that. Yeah, but he's killing. <laughs> but for the right girl, you're gonna want to do stuff like that. That's and real. Then I and have... He felt like it was the right person. Yeah. 